I fucking hate Necro. I don't even know why the fuck I made this team. I fucking shit. Yeah, I really want 12 players. That's the thing. I, I, I'm going to have to keep both of them for now. Whether it's AV6 or, or minus it, or AG3, I've got to keep them because I've got to keep 12 men's for the one turner. That was fucking bollocks, though, wasn't it? I would have... Uh... I blitzed the mighty blow guy. He only had one tackler, that was a thing, so I could have blitzed him and then double marked the catchers. One with double sidestep, one with tackle and sidestep. So, like, the ta the catchers would have been completely taken out of the equation. And then, I'll, you know, the, the tackler would have been down. And then I could have, you know, made a dodge to base him. So, and then that would have passed. So, I really played it very badly. Really did play it very badly. Um, yeah, of course, I know I'm down to TV every game. Fucking happy day. I don't even care. I, I, you can't do that. You can't do that. You can't do it, little Buzz. You just literally can't do it. Because if you play Nurgle, it's get tortured for 20 games. I shouldn't even play this game because no good can come from this game. I can't put it on YouTube because I'm going to be salty as hell. It's going to be maybe uh, not very entertaining because I'm going to be salty as hell. So no, no, it's just a game of football, isn't it? It doesn't matter. No one died. Well, someone did die. I guess I just need to play about ten more games with that team now. Dimmy, maybe it's time to recreate your ogre team for this ladder. Remember how fun it was? It was all sunshine and rainbows instead of this Jim Shard BS. Yeah, it was. The, the, the Woodies was all sunshine and rainbow. Thanks for the bits. The Woodies was all sunshine and rainbows when, uh, when they were working. But when you're all double ones and your opponent makes a chasm every block, um, not actually as fun. My head's, my head's gone. My head's gone. I'll have to tell her to turn off the mic because I can't say anything good. So I'll, I'll just have to turn off the mic for a bit. What I, re what I need now is a jolly northern chap to tell some irrelevant story or give some good ball advice to people and then it would be alright, wouldn't it? And I could just sit and fume. That'd be pretty nice, but um, I don't have that luxury, so I'll just have to sit, sit and fume in silence. <laughs> Streamer House was pretty good, I like Streamer House. I don't know that I could play Sims 2 on I don't think I could stream Sims 2 on this laptop. Yeah, I'll stream it. Streamer house was brilliant, wasn't it? <laughs> I'll, I'll go on my Discord. I'll go on my Discord, and if anybody wants to talk on on the stream, you can. But don't don't say fuck or bugger. It doesn't have me as... Oh yeah, it does. Okay. I'm working now. If you want to be my Zunk, then you can join in.
What I like is when people fucking make frenzy fucking trap blitzers and then dodge away with their wolves every time. Every time. No punish. Ever. Have you noticed that? Have you noticed when people play against you, that's what they do every time? They don't think, oh, maybe, maybe I should take like a blitz with block here because I'm going to follow with my wolf and I'll have to three plus dodge away. They don't give a fuck. They do it, they dodge away, they're happy. Every fucking time. Let's do a pass. Yeah, well done. Realised I fucking got him, but he ain't got the uh, ain't got the foul, has he? How can this guy can he dodge and GFI twice or something? Well, that action ended in a Kaz. <laughs> exactly, exactly the Kaz I thought it would end in. That gives new meaning to the word fucking Jim Fowl. Team one two jelly deals. Um, no thanks to the region. Uh, no nineteen one two. I, uh, I had the misfortune to play Murloc Jaw. <laughs> Murloc Jaw Murloc Jaw doesn't do anything except fucking murder death kill. This is why fucking Jellyel's the worst, isn't he? He's the fucking worst. <laughs> He's the fucking worst. What a scumbag. <laughs> if you quit yeah no I mean you know I could have still maybe drawn but I had what five players left on the pitch they were gonna get fucking hit by mighty blow and fouled I couldn't really protect them and you know if I lose in a one turn I don't know the team's dead Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> I could do that as well. <laughs> but uh, I might get I might get banned off Twitch for being <laughs> being a uh, you know. Something. Right, I think I can surf the wolf. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna look too carefully. I'm just gonna hope that it works. Surfing. Okay. Acceptable. Yeah, I misplayed. I misplayed to let him equalise. So if I hadn't misplayed to let him equalise and I was still 1-0 up, I wouldn't have conceded because I would have thought, even if the team gets ruined, I'll still win. Whereas now, there was a there was a decent chance of losing as well. Jellio doesn't know, though. It doesn't fucking matter to him. But, you know, for everybody else, I absolutely fucked up on the... Uh, on the turn eight, it was a horrible turn eight. I should have blitzed the map. <laughs> just based the catchers. Because I had to base one catcher anyway. Didn't I? Yeah, I think there was just one perm because the other one had already happened, so I think. Unless somebody died. I don't think anyone died. Did they? Maybe someone died. Oh, yeah, I think someone died. Yeah, yeah I think maybe someone died. I think there was two perms on level vinyl, so yeah, I think one died. Not sure. Not sure, though. Feels bad, man. <laughs> Try to get him to.
Let me punch your balls. The fuck? I might get hit with the ball here, but fuck it. If he doesn't, next turn I'm gone. Oh yeah, Legion League, yeah, I don't know. Rebel, I think. T Self is sometimes, sometimes says things in chat. Sam Davies is around, isn't he? I don't know about the rest. That wasn't a random one, was it? I mean, it was one that he, he, he gave up for no reason. Wolves are pretty good, aren't they? When they get blocked and you don't, you don't, you're not scared to blitz with them. Well, I've learned today. Also, don't ever fucking play against my left field ever. Number one tip for winning games of football and, and keeping your team alive. Turn this turn, isn't it? Huge turn. Get it completely in the way. Team Nicholas, I don't know. Didn't target him because that just to get just to get forward. The name of this cage is the arrow. <laughs> Fuck off ever playing against no Joe ever again, Cage. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> it was like four cards in the first five turns. And I missed them. I mean, the miss, the miss. It wasn't really a miss, Quake. It was miss. Miss dealing with Cyanide's client. 
and then misplay now didn't score. I mean that was the worst. That was unforgivable. That was horrible that he didn't score. Both down there, I don't know what he's going to do. Easy as you like. Absolute autopilot auto game is going pretty well, isn't it? Yeah. Just quietly. <laughs> this isn't going badly. Uh, way better than I thought it would go. Even about my fucking shit play, because I didn't want to fucking concede, even with five players left. If I just fucking played better, even though I rolled shit, I did roll three, two ones out of three rolls. But I mean, I was trying to make three two plus rolls. But I just, it was the wrong play. In retrospect, it was the wrong play. So I deserve to fail So that's pretty fucking annoying, isn't it? Yeah, I shouldn't win here. Almost certainly, unless something stupid happens. There's three and oh, Necro just without, without ever trying with them. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Might have to score here though. Mm, maybe not, he's in the room. Do this, don't fog score. It's a fucking GFI. Oh, I did exactly the same as what I did against Murloc Joe. Exactly the fucking same. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, I'm not happy with it, no, because, uh, well, that was a vague, vague chance to draw. A vague, fucking, very slim chance to draw. But I couldn't risk a, a positional down for, a, for a slim chance to draw. I'm just pissed off that I fucking fucked up the defense. That's what I'm pissed off. Oh. Even though I was in the... It doesn't matter if you're unlucky if you misplay, is it? You shouldn't misplay. Simple as. No point making the wrong move and come down right the other. Yeah, exactly. Just couldn't protect the players, the good players at all. And for a chance of a draw. If it had been for the chance of a win. You know, I, I wouldn't have dreamt of conceding. If, I, if I'd stopped his score and I was 1-0 up, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have thought about conceding. And I should have stopped his score. Because he, he did a bad one-turn attempt and I did a fucking bad fucking one-turn stopping. Actually, I should have blitzed him so I could have blocked him as well. Rather than just trying... No, oh, I can deal with him as well. I should have should moved him over there this time. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, I went in Discord so that is if you you can you can commentate if you want, Squirrel do. You can you can be the commentator, man. You can be my jolly northern friend. Yeah, yeah. I think it, I think it. We're not the trying to lose an audience, Jim. I should talk as little as possible. Oh yeah, hello, squirrel dude. I have so much time in the mornings for activities. <laughs> so many activities. Right, I'll, I'll just I'll just let you speak for me. Thank you, Zunk. And now welcome to my co-host. He's not a sidekick. He's a co-host, uh, fully qualified. I'll, I'll I'll just go make cups of tea and stuff and and sit looking depressed. Let your your significant other for food. Five. No rocket cars today. person who's probably played in the past two months, the person in Discord chat. Not the people who actually run random leagues, like Tony. Which chat? Because I remember that I hate my voice. Get over it at some point. I hate my voice too, don't worry, we, we can't all be Zunk. <laughs> uh, right, that's good. A horror kickoff event that isn't horribly swingy, just the one that I think. Are you sure it led to a touchback for Guinness in the World Cup? Because he it ended up going to the side and then nice weather scattered it off the field. Out of the two turn and tied the game against Scapin. 
because he had an awful offset offense that if it was a blitz and the ball had been to the other side, he would have lost the game. Gavin. He doesn't need to be changed. First actual skill on a wolf after a stat up seems strange. Go dodge, because Agi 4 dodge is really good. Or wrestle. Tackle. Wrestle's doing the same thing that. Six times. the uh, way the AI just chooses to level up all their wolves. Like, I think uh, if you play, like, super high team value AI teams by cheesing it and, like, building a custom team, um, they'll take tackle, kickoff return, fend, block on all of their wolves. They're strange. Please. Always, of course, questionable with their claw first, all chaos men's strategy being well known. I sound terrible at all times. Not the 2 GFI 3 plus dodge scoring threat. I guess he's going for a 3 dice block. Just 2. Needed to have 3 assists for that, I guess. The AI teams take. Eight rerolls, and then in, in inducements they will buy. They will get a chef, and the extra four rerolls. Nine assistant coaches, but no cheerleaders. I think it's one or the other. They're quite strange. You sound just like the old Scottish grandmother that you are. KOs the white up the field and completely their team. And if Jim was a bit more forward, he could have just completely run up the field to the right side. Um, it's one of the subtle draw uh, drawbacks of fouls, of course, is that yes, they do remove players, but now his entire team four players is out of position. Easy gap to just run through. Between the two positions, even, so it's not even that well protected in that regard. I have brown hair. Johnny Five, so I am pretty shit. Playing a 2 GFI, 1 dice block with the white. Oh, 
old zombies getting rando cast and leveling up. Because those are the players you want all the SPP on. Pretty player. And then hopefully die at some point. GFI to prevent the double GFI. That's fine. Marking a guy so he can be a frenzy trap to the wolf. Might blitz the white into a frenzy trap. Past events. This is great. It's like I'm playing a game, but also getting to watch a stream at the same time. <laughs> That's what I do, but usually I'm playing a different game. Commentary on myself. But it's that, it's just like, why is he making all these GFIs? What is with this 3 plus dodge? Why is he taking blocks and not playing the ball? I've got to be honest, I didn't check his record, but... You know, he's taken... <laughs> he's taken and taken tackle first on both walls, he's got one reroll. It's safe to say he's not he's not the best player on earth. There it is. There's the frenzy trap blitz. Right on cue. Yeah. It's the K it's the armor break, it's the KO. <laughs> Werewolves. No, They're those no. predictable fuckers. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing is more predictable than that. Rando Kaz, which my flush golems are not ever able to do. Yeah. Better, I'm pretty sure I've had Black Orc sitting on zero SPP for 17 games. Mm. 50 blocks. Could do the blitz here, couldn't I? It's uh. He just blitz out the blitz out the white run away. Mm. I could Piles do gym, the and Fash Binder would freak out. Yeah, because the the one in nine, you don't like, but it doesn't end your turn. So, dark great. I think. I think it's pushes, I guess. Plus, I might just kill him. Why not? And now it's two 0 I'm playing like elves again now. He's got no rerolls. He's down a werewolf and a flesh golem. Potentially two zombies, including a guard zombie. Instead of turning over, aren't terrible. And getting a third one. <gasps> Glorious Unbelievable, kills. Jeff. Bloodweiser babes for shit, and you should never buy them. <laughs> pretty huge though because the biggest downside of your team construction is you don't have double fleshies so you can be out of strength and all of a sudden that's just kind of not there anymore you just don't have that problem two faster ghouls instead of shit zombies yeah I actually meant to buy a flesh golem before this game I forgot and then bought a wizard instead <laughs> so that's not great really. allowed you to score on his offense so Probably technically worth it, but it might not have been needed this game. Hello, Grid Ziggini. Yeah, well, it was a A free reroll. Instantly use it because 
<laughs> he didn't have sure hands. Yeah. He had effectively extra arms. <laughs> Neither of I. I haven't seen the uh, one flesh golem build either, my little girl. They just did it. <laughs> Interesting no, base for cage. The best. Do, do you recommend this this offensive course of action? Maybe if you put the flesh golem on the base and then to double base the person who is marking it with a couple of zombies to make it unblockable, um, including the guard zombie. Oh, it's got a blitz, so it's, it's okay. He's obviously going to blitz it off, but I mean that would be the situation where you do it. You just make it so that it's impossible to block it off. Yeah, like this. This very guy, very hard to actually put a hole. Brian the Demon Hunter should have been. One square across, so he'd be covering it. Yeah. Brian the demon hunter. What a name. Imagine if there was a demon hunter called Brian. Brian, like brining, brining a fish or meat before you cook it. No, just Brian. It's just you know, it's not a very sexy later, name. So he's got like he's got two of them, two Brians. Ah. <laughs> there are streams where extra arms go to get you banned, that's true. Yeah, that's transactionally literally true, isn't it, Shawnee? <laughs> Rest in peace, Shawnee. Right, I should probably try and score with somebody other than the whale, shouldn't I? So, uh, this random girl's gonna score this tribe. Carnivore Splitter. It's a good name, isn't it? For, like splitting carnivores. Carnivores or carnivals? Carnivores. carnivores. Oh, that was a dodge. That was a good play, wasn't it? Misclick. No, I just missed. World Cup level play right there. Yep, yeah, World Cup. World Cup champs ladder qualifying with Olga's play that. The whole oh, idea was just that I could. <laughs> I wouldn't have to talk, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get back to me being muted. Thank you, Squirrel Dude. It was either no, it was Spartaco's opponent that did an accidental five plus dodge with the a quirk. Lost him his turn. Almost forced a draw on that drive though. I always thought that if you didn't notice the dodge, it couldn't fail. I've been I've been caught out by it about half the time when I make a four plus dodge. It's weird. I figured it'd been way less than that. It turns out to be almost exactly half the time. Kind of bad. Blitzing the ball, just gonna hit a white. I might have taken the one dice block, but I'm pretty hyper aggressive. Tell us, there are definitely been times where I've played an opponent and I was I was curious that they might have had dice hacks because they seemed to end their turn at a very strange point and then I rolled dub skulls. Dumb and I'm just kind of bad and should not worry about it. Russian players, so there definitely there was no way they could be hacking because only Russians hack, obviously. When it's a point one and thirty six is a dodge out.
the reason you would take plus strength on the Minotaur uh, Sleeper Sif is because it means that you get solo three dice blocks against strength three players when he blitzes. Really good for taking down big guys um, and helping you give you a strength advantage. Chaos, I'm going to assume you mean like Chaos Pact? You have like you should have tons of claw mighty blow everywhere, and that the, you had to roll doubles to get the first place. So he's already like 210 team value. See the um so that if I remember my Minotaur being 150 plus 30 plus 30. Yeah. The issue is that like yeah, because you're not gonna get tentacles without another doubles. Like, what is good? They'd probably take it because you already have block. It's less good in a way on a Minotaur because you're already getting like six strength on a Blitz. Um, but I would because at this point you're kind of pot committed to having a Minotaur, and you might as well be amazing. And your Chaos Pact, so who gives a shit? Mid Max bullshit. Uh, Dark Elf with mutation access, so. That's the gimmick, you might as well roll with it, and he'll die at some point, because he's armor 8. It's a giant target, but he'll be strength 6 with luck, so who's gonna hit him? Probably be my next level up on him afterwards, for the... Strength 6. Strength, I don't think strength, I don't think the horns would apply to it. I've had a strength six. I've had a strength six roger with block before, and being able to easily get three dice blocks them so much more reliable. The balls looks to be pretty safe, especially with those pushes. It's gonna be pretty hard for the werewolf to get. Werewolf can do a bunch of can run around because werewolves are never not in the play, but. The ghoul is at risk, but I wouldn't be too worried about the ball quite yet at this moment. Which might be what I would take before pro, but... Uh. On big guys, but the thing is, you kind of—it's one of those things you want to have a lot of, but it's expensive because you need to have a lot of it for it to actually activate and proc and spawn game. For a white, off a rando Kaz into a death. Tyrant's gonna get mighty blower guard. All the double skills and all the stats on Snotlings, especially plus strength, but even more than that, you always take plus agility, because they definitely need it. Um, they need all the agility they can get. Didn't have Claw, he had Block. He rolled... He was Block, Guard. Rank? It might have been... Hard block plus armor value because what else am I gonna take? Yeah, I could have taken break tackle, but I hate break tackle big guys, so
Just happened. Old random failure of a pass onto fumble into being caught by the pass target. Standard. That, okay. One. Long time since I saw that one. Easy pass, so unlucky. The opponent get surfs on again the frenzy trap block just making you roll pals and being useless like usual Mole Dripster, uh, Jimmy conceded after he had five L's left on Joe's offense after Joe got a riot into a tie after Jimmy kind of screwed up with two-turn defense. This is Zappo. So he did a diaper man concession. Also, half of his team, but, you know, who, who's counting? Actually, it wasn't a riot. It was just uh, I was just forced to score early, and then uh, due to not having, I think I had three players on the pitch, um, and then all the tails came back. But I, uh, I just failed the two-turn defense. That was that was what it was. If I hadn't failed at the two-turn defense, then um, then I wouldn't have conceded because I'd be one 0 up, and I would. Be looking at a draw at worst and a win at best, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't have conceded then. But as it was, it was pretty shit. Jim does have a surf on the werewolf. The plus agility never fails the frenzy trap blitz. <laughs> That's a good point. That's something I didn't consider. He's not Andy Davo, so and he's got a sheet of paper that says never surf, so we'll see if he actually goes for it. Fuck it. I, I don't play enough games to concede very often. I did do like the shittiest thing ever, which was play orcs, and I decided, you know what? All these people who complain about Nurgle, they're babies. I'm gonna play Nurgle with my orcs, and like by turn eight, I was like, yeah, this is fucking bullshit and conceited. <laughs> well, I'm like, so yeah, I had like lost like five players, including a death into death by the Apo, because of course it was. There's no point splat surfing the wolf, is there? Plus it was something that... Maybe I should have done, because I haven't got an apple. <laughs> so yeah, now he's going to get punched, isn't he? Maybe I should have done that one. Yeah. 
Marsh again showing his mastery of assists by it looks like bringing in two players to get a two dice block on strength three again. I wonder if he just can't, like, fa if he doesn't find a frenzy trap. Nope, okay. I was going to postulate that as long as it wasn't a frenzy trap, he could never roll pals, but that doesn't look to be the case. <laughs> However, he rolled double pals, but if it was a frenzy trap, he would have still got the knockdown. <laughs> In Hippie, I wouldn't mind, but I'm also a person who's proposed like an entirely radically different injury table, so... No worry. On a lot of things. Heterodox views on Blood Bowl at this point, uh, with being called a baby who hates Blood Bowl when I suggested that maybe Blitz is slightly overpowered. <laughs> yeah, it's tough. It's tough. Isn't to a get, good event. It's tough to get anybody to consider anything, anything new. But then the problem is that, as somebody said, they wouldn't trust anyone except themselves to make changes, which is. Which is a fine, a fine thing in it. When you think how bad. Hard to trust people when they're like, you know what we need? Let's give gutter runners a really shit, pointless skill that can only hurt games. Yeah. And how do we buff humans? <laughs> yeah. 10k least ex less expensive. That solves the problem of having a fucking movement, a uh, fucking skink as their like catcher. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's not good, is it? I should have taken guard then. I just took mighty blow as a reflex. <laughs> reflex mighty blow. <laughs> then you have to sit there and consider like guard for five minutes before taking mighty blow. I should have. I should have. I should have taken guard, but um, didn't. Do that. The flesh golem was probably the correct thing to do. Three and zero oh, though, with this random not caring about any game team, which is pretty good, isn't it? So, um... Four wolves are kind of good, and can help a lot. <laughs> yeah. Blah, 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 stay fantastic. <laughs>